Welcome to Tada 360 Degree Productions. Would you care to introduce yourself? Hi, my name is Taliba. I am a pop and R&B artist based out of Charlotte, North Carolina, originally from New Jersey. Definitely looking forward to putting Charlotte on the map. Yes. Awesome, awesome. When did you first start singing? Um, I'm, I originally started singing at the age of eight. I didn't take it serious until I got about 14 when I realized I actually had a voice. And um, it just took off from there. What did your family do to encourage you? Um, all of my family is definitely musically inclined. All my aunts, uncles, just everybody. Everybody plays instruments, they sing. So we did talent shows together, block parties, all types of events, all types of events. So um, just coming from a musical background, my family was definitely supportive of everything that I did with my music career. Great. Great. Who else in your family sings? Um, sibling wise, uh, my older sister she sings, but she never really wanted to take it as like a serious career. And it's about seven of us, but I, that's it. <laughs> Nobody else actually sings. Maybe writing and things like that. But all of my aunts and uncles basically are singing and playing instruments. Just everybody, but. Nobody really took it, you know, to the next level. So, besides church. <laughs> Why am I looking at you? Oh, okay. So, I guess you're taking it to the next level. And who are your musical inspirations? Um, I would say my biggest inspiration coming up was Whitney Houston, Mariah Carey, um... They were my biggest inspiration in music. I really took to Mary J. Blige, um, lyrically wise, as far as, you know, really putting your heart on the line when it came to reality in music. Um, but coming up, those were my, those were my idols. What kind of music do you listen to today? Oh man. So many genres, pop, rock, pop rock, <laughs> gospel, country music, hip hop, everything, everything. I think it's important to open your mind to all different types of genres when you're in music because, you know, it just, it just broadens everything when it comes to your craft. Just seeing, you know, other cultures and different types of music, different genres, just everything. I think it's important to listen to a lot of different music. Yes. Most definitely, I totally, totally agree. What embarrassing songs might I find in your MP3 player? <laughs> well, <laughs> that all depends. Um, you might find, oh man. <laughs> I, I, I'm not even going to answer that I'm going to say it all depends on what you feel is embarrassing Because I, I, I have some things that may be shocking to some people When they hear it come on Because it's, it's totally left of what I do as an artist But, you know, I'll just say that <laughs> Oh wow, you don't want to let us know what's going on on that MP3 player where would you most like to perform? Um, I think every artist's dream is to be able to perform at Madison Square Garden. That's, that would be a huge opportunity. Like, I, I would love to perform there. Love to. Who would you most like to open for? That's a hard one. <laughs> That's hard. Um, to open for. I would say right now, as far as relevance and um, my direction of music and everything as a whole, like I, I would definitely like to do some things with Rihanna. 
I would love to have an opportunity to open up for someone like Beyonce or if I had to do an artist other than pop and R&B, I would say I don't know if I would choose anybody else. I don't know. Okay, that sounds awesome, Rihanna. She sounds like someone that would be awesome to just work with. Beyonce, definitely. And if you were singing, what would you be doing? I think if I, if, if I was a singer, I, I would definitely get into writing. Well, I am currently writing a lot. And... It, it basically coincides with each other. So I feel like writing is a huge part of music. So if I wasn't singing, I would definitely put my whole heart into just writing. Day in and day out, writing good music because that's just, it's just a part of my passion. It's something that you can do at any time. It, it, it'll never take away from nothing, but it's still sticking to something that's really in my heart. So I would definitely be writing. Can you sing something for us? <laughs> what would you like for me to sing? <laughs> um, I think Alicia Keys, this girl's on fire. Do you know that? Um, I could sing a piece of it. Okay, that would be crazy. <laughs> <laughs> right. She's just a girl and she's on fire. Hotter than a fantasy. Lonely like a highway. She's living in a world and it's on fire. <laughs> so Mylon as a hobby. That's really it. Just regular. Oh yes, I see you have many things you do in your spare time and that sounds pretty good, pretty great. And who is your celebrity crush? I know it's a lot of eye candy out there, hunt too. My celebrity crush? Oh, oh. Um, I don't know. I don't know. So funny. <laughs> Zero Ray, how you doing from the game? Oh, how you doing? Oh. And I, mm, Trey Songs, how you doing? And celebrity crush. Uh, I, think, I think that pretty much sums it up. <laughs> how you doing, Tyree? Oh, Tyree. <laughs> Chocolate thunder, honey. Woo! She got me over here hot with this little choice that she got for her celebrity crushes. Tyree Pooch from the game and Trey Songz. Well, we're going to get ready to wrap this up and we're going to tell you how you can contact Mr. Lever. Um, if you would like to check out some of my music, you can catch me on Reverb Nation. That will be Reverb Nation backslash Taliba. Um, my Twitter is TalibaB1, and on my Facebook would be um, facebook.com backslash TalibaB1. All right, thanks for joining us at Tada's 360 Degrees Production, where everything is great. Until next time, stay tuned and God bless. She's just a girl and she's
Situation is so complicated. You got about 60 seconds to change it before I go inside of my room and pull out that Beretta and I take it to you. Somebody better please call 911. He's testing me, and you best believe this fool got less than 60 seconds before he turn a beauty to a beast. In less than 60 seconds before he turn a beauty to a beast. Or have to end up on a cover of a magazine And I ain't talking, baby, lady yeah, you never seen a side of me before And I know You wish you would've never tried to put on a show Nice camera action And now you're a victim to my satisfaction I'm taking you out And you know this is hard to stay focused with you In my face and this pain on my brain And I hope that you know you got 